Hey guys, it's Dr. Emmer. We're finishing up our day. Um, it's been a great week so far for all of you following because we're doing a lot of great procedures. And we have a student here learning too, so it's very exciting. We're doing our InstaLift procedure. If you take a look here, this is a suture that has little baby cones on them. It's called bi-directional because if you see on the left side, the cones are facing one direction. And if you see on the other side, the cones are facing the other direction. And there's a little space in between. That's the anchor point. That's this little dot right here. These threads go under the skin and then anchor right in the middle to hold that skin up. And I have a very young patient who's just starting to notice a little bit of looseness in her tissue and some increasing nasal labial folds. And remember, as I've been talking in the past, we used to just fill those lines. And then the problem was that people look puffy, they look overdone. Um, what we've learned over the past few years is that it's not always about volume. Sometimes we really need to lift the skin. So what we're doing here is replacing these threads to give her underlying support to help lift that area and over time build collagen. There's other things we can do externally like Thermage, Ulthera, um, microneedling radiofrequency like the Morpheus or Fractora treatments, etc. But this is a good initial big improvement that she will get and will last her up to two years of building collagen in that area. And what we're doing here is we're literally going under the surface and anchoring those sutures, hold on one second, just gonna do, into the spots that we want to get her a nice lift. And long term, that's gonna give her a nice underlying support without ever having to have, good, okay, go ahead. Without having to have a lift, an early lift. And there's other things that we can do some fillers to give some lifting and we can soften the line, etc. But this is a good actual procedure to give her some tightening. Now there's different types of threads and we were just talking about this, one's called PDO, that have little barbs on them. Those are also good, but I have found they don't last as long. And some people, especially active younger people, they can move. So there's nothing wrong with them, and I think they can be added here. Um, but I find that the insulin threads are just going to give you a lot softer of a look. They're more preventative. You can add to them, and they're very vectoring. Like I can create shape and contour quite easily. Uh, with this and which is what I'm doing a very high lift the best that I can um, with her uh, with these threads and I'm going all the way up into the hairline to give a nice um, lift in that area so you can see we're going all the way up and we're vectoring these and they go right under there nice and safe and we can literally look at this can literally pull her folds all the way up and if I grab all the threads Look how much of her face I can actually lift. So grab here, grab there. Once we tighten, look at that. So the goal is that's what's gonna happen over time. Do you have any pain? No. Minimal. So that's what's also great about this. Such minimal pain, you can go ahead and mark here, and if it's done well, it's such an excellent procedure for long-term. And I've had a lot of people that like to do this um, preventatively. Will you give me this, the long uh, smooths? How is this different from Nova Threads? Well, that's what we just, we just said. Oh. <laughs> Go back in the video and I'll, you guys can learn that, but I'm also gonna show you here, I'm gonna throw in some additional threads here. These are Nova Threads, but these are the smooth ones. And to give her more of a contour laterally, we're gonna throw a couple of these, we're gonna do a little pinch. We're gonna throw right under the base there. And what that's gonna do is help us give a little bit more tightening to that area a little bit more definition in between each of these threads right here these longer smooth threads are going to give more collagen production for her okay we're going you see here right through that area one more perfect to give her a lot of lifting here and collagen production long term all the way down to the fold we're going to pull those out those now embed under the skin and those bed those little baby sutures under the skin right beside those other thicker threads so now we're going to rotate to the other side and i'll show you guys it when we tighten the skin great it's so quick i know we're going to go to the other side now you'll be done 
turn to the left. I do this a lot, by the way. Yeah, <laughs> I hope so. We were we were laughing about that, like John and I, because when we first started this years ago, the rep was like, "This should take like an hour to an hour and a half." I'm mm-hmm. like, "What?" Mm-hmm. I'm like, "To who?" I was like, "That's crazy." Yeah, when John said, "I'm like, how long do you think?" Like twenty minutes. I'm like, "Oh wow." Okay. I know. I know. 